the Kenya Revenue Authority, or KRA, has nabbed more than 1,112 tons of contaminated sugar at the port of Mombasa, triggering panic among consumers that some may have been cleared for sale. Now, according to KRE, out of the 46 containers full of imported household sugar, 13 containers have been condemned with more investigations ongoing. Stephen Leto reports. Citizen TV has acquired images from the busy port of Mombasa, showing a sting operation that led to the seizure of more than 1,112 tons of sugar suspected to be contaminated. The 46 containers of household sugar had docked at the port of Mombasa late last year, with 13 containers confirmed by the Kenya Revenue Authority to have been contaminated following a mechanical hitch that led to flooding of water inside the consignment, making it unfit for human and consumption. Documents seen so far show that Rehema Badi, who is the official importer of the multi-million shillings sugar consignment, used Elevon Logistics Limited to import the sugar from Mauritius at a cost of 214 million shillings. Uh, immediately then I was told by KRA they are auctioning my sugar. You understand? So when I was told they are auctioning, I had to look for that money from a, a friend yes. and Kopeche, then when I sell, I will return the money. Okay, so this guy came, gave me 30 million, I paid for taxes. But then, in these 46 containers, 36 containers had water. The other 33 were clean. So, uh, we got um, a letter from KRA. The businesswoman says out of the 46 containers held, only 13 have been confirmed not to have passed the test, claiming that the 33 remaining containers are safe. We followed the due process, we got the letter. So, Skari, it can do a Mitchell court. Okay? Yes. So now we followed the process I paid. Apparently, I paid even for the bad sugar because mm. they said I'm paying for one BL. They didn't want to hear. A level company that imported the sugar had made several payments to the Kenya Revenue Authority, including 30 million shillings as tax and an additional 6 million shillings as inspection fee. The importer now wants KRA to pay back money equivalent to the 13 containers that have been condemned. Kenya Revenue Authority and the Kenya Bureau of Standards Cabs have again sampled the 33 remaining containers to establish their suitability to be released to the market. Rehema Body who imported the sugar consignment has dismissed fears that some of the contaminated sugar is already in the Kenyan market. A joint multi-agency operation is ongoing that is led by the DCI and Port Health officials to establish the whereabouts of any other possible contaminated sugar either in the port of Mombasa or that may have been cleared into the Kenyan market. Stephen Leto, Citizen TV.